So I'm off down this morning for a little ride I'm down to one of the very few AA boxes that are left in the country. This one's been refurbished a bit and it's down in the little village of Bruton in Somerset. So uh, it's not a massive distance away, this is quite nice. And um, I'm just basically going out there to take some pictures of the bike next to it. And uh, also just testing out the settings on the cameras ready for the weekend's ride because it's a big one. It's the uh, yearly event. Ride to the Tide from Trowbridge down to Paul. So that'll be quite good. First time I've ever done it. So uh, yeah, I believe this. A few people from the Sports of Sickness go in and there'll be a few from Region 14 from the Hardy Riders Club going as well, so I'm told. You usually get well over a hundred bikes going down there, down the pool, so I'm looking forward to seeing how that all works out. So I'm just testing the 360 over that side of it, just to see what sort of um, angle that gives me. I've got me uh, sat nav thingy on there, the old auto car. And I'm powering both of the, uh, well all of it, I'm powering them all off battery uh, power banks at the minute. Just to see how that works. It worked quite well on the uh, right of Wales the other day. Managed to get all the way back there and back again. I think we're out for a good four or five hours and uh, yeah, no dramas. in here, take a few pictures, I've got the camera in the backpack, a couple of lenses, got my phone, it's all been well, I'm going to stop off and pick up some food for tea as well later on at the farm shop, get a bit of steak or something. Cloudy day today, not as warm. Let's see where the old satnav throws us, see which way it wants to take us today. I think it says 31 minutes, that's not bad. It does, uh, it does ride brick like hell on these bars on the Harley. So I'm really glad I haven't put a foam mount on because that would break your heart. So this looks like it's going to be the quickest route up here. I'm not surprised. I think the traffic up ahead is going to be a bit murderous at the junctions. So this one's usually a bit easier to get out of. We'll just see what happens.
I have learned that going into a corner on these things, you've got to be a lot more uh, reserved. Unlike a sports bike, we can throw it in, lean it over, flick it about a bit. These, uh, these bikes, they don't enjoy it. So you've got to be a bit more reserved on the corners. Yeah, busy, busy, busy. One thing I am enjoying at least is the self cancelling indicators. What a joy that is. I think all bikes have self cancelling indicators. That's different. I don't see many people turning up that way. Mm, yeah, today. The roads around here are getting uh, quite claggy at the minute. There'll be a lot of, lot of hold-ups, I expect, because the A36 is shut between Limpy Stoke and Bath. And that's causing a bit of mayhem all around. People are trying to do all sorts of mad shit to get on the routes they want to go on. None of it seems to work too well. I'm just hoping when I get here that there won't be any one part across it because it is right next to the old station and signal box. Um, yeah, so hopefully we'll have a free run at it. No, no chance of keeping up there now. Some days you get a nice little run up the hill. Not today. I'm only going down uh, this roundabout onto the next one at Nunny Cash and then we turn off to the left. And we're only 15 minutes out, so it's pretty good already. See the time properly. I think it's oh, ten to ten to ten. Ten to ten. Well, that's all right. Do this. Fly on back. Stop get some food. Give the dog a later walk today. Should have to go a bit later. You don't mind you be asleep on the bed anyway. Slowly getting used to the riding position on this bike. The old legs a bit akimbo. Massive air filter there, look. Thing there. Apparently it's the Arlen Ness Big Sucker air filter. Wasn't quite sure, so I put it on one of the forums and the guys came back and said, oh yeah, it's Arlen Ness, which uh, fits in nicely with the uh, Van Heinz short shots and the fuel map monitor on there as well. I think it's the FP3. Hello, 
shenanigans here, look. What the hell's going on here, look? There's a lot of works. That's all we an interesting ride back. A lot of tarmac lorries about. I mean, there's nowhere they're going to try and tarmac this during the day. You know, there is. Yeah, I think they are. It looks like the old somersault's coming out. No overtaking signs going out. Yeah, grit, 20 mile an hour. Shit, the bed. Oh, I don't think I want to come back this way then, because that'll be as fucking shaky as fuck, that wall. Oh my god. I think I'll have to take the other shitty road. Jesus Christ. Maybe well works, good risk, yeah. <sighs> Blue sky, right? Blue sky! Oh, there's a, uh, what's that, a road sweeper? Oh no, that's the guy with a bitumen in there. So he'll be laying that shit down and then they'll be dropping the stones on top. So that's nice. There's loads of them coming up through, look. But luckily, we're off right this way. For a minute. Head down to Bruton. Bruton, eight mile. Here we go. Well, I've been down here a couple of times, I don't know the road that well. But we're just potting along at 50. Nice little ride for the Wiltshire country. Oh, I guess this is Somerset now, isn't it? Somerset countryside. Just gone over the border. Let's wake them up a little bit. Only five gears in here, not six. Come on. I'm glad I wrapped up warm for this, Jesus Christ. Read it in a bit. I know these sort of places love to do some speed traffic. One straight over. What a difference in the weather this is now. Jesus, the last few days it's been like, you know, really bakey. So, I've not really wanted to go out too much. And today it was like, well, it's going to be a bit overcast. There shouldn't be any rain until later on. But, you never know. Lots of twisty, he's got some farmyards, so we've got to watch out for tractors this time of year because it is the season. Once they get the uh, crops in, they'll be out ploughing. Oh yeah, pick your own sunflowers. Oh yeah, nice little filter. Eh? Well, hopefully, they'll be back. I can never run, but I doubt it. This is like a bit of a main archery. I get you to the 303 quite quick. So, what are we now? Eight minutes out? That's not bad. That's all right. It'd be better if this guy in front wasn't putting the brakes on every fucking 30 seconds, but.
little farm shop. My wife loves a farm shop. Fresh fruit and veg, country cheeses, tomatoes, bread, meals. God, I like this. Didn't see a butcher there, so I a bit of a let down. I don't know of any other farm shops this way, really. Right, coming down into Bruton now. This looks at them. Look at that, they are nice, isn't it? Twenty mile an hour limit at thirty five. Take this road to Wing Canton. Well, we're still on the twenty, are we? All right. And we're just coming around the corner now, and we should hopefully see the. There's the old station there, that. Oh, good. Oh, there we go. Drop in lane, look. What can I, what have I done there? Bit of a pisser on it. Oh, oh, someone's walked it, look. Yeah, not going to throw it out, look. 